Hi, how you doing? Scott Hi. from Hey You Guys, lovely to meet you. Um, in this long process you've had a couple of years when you've gone from your short story to this, you must be delighted with the way the film's worked out and the reaction so far. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm living the dream. It's absolutely impossible to believe that I'm here, to be honest. <laughs> uh, you had this, this short story, which is the beginning of the film, which is very kind of ferocious, but also quite touching in a way, because it's children and stuff. Was that the basis of your, you know, in terms of the story, in terms of going out there? Yeah, it was, it was, uh, I, I wrote it as the short. I wrote the short in four days, and I sent oh, wow. it in, and it did very well. It got nominated for a couple of uh, a couple of awards, uh, it got well reviewed, but I sort of felt like it wasn't over. There's more to that character. There's more to that world. And I really wanted to go back and, and explore, explore further. So I pitched it as a novel. I pitched it as a as a screenplay, and then had the weird experience of getting yes twice at the same time. And I ended up writing the, the screenplay and the novel back to back, which was uh, which was awesome. It must be great to work with producers that obviously kept you on board because sometimes you know obviously there's books and they can go for other people. To be involved in the whole process must have been must have been great. Yeah, and and, uh, and again, sort of like completely unique in my experience. Uh, Colin, the director, came on board very very early on, so there was a long time when it was basically we were all in a room, the producers, Colin and myself, sort of working out the beats, arguing about the uh, the character arcs and so on. And it really felt like we forged it together, we owned it together, and then what appears on screen is exactly what was in our heads at that time. In terms of the casting, uh, I was just talking to the producer there, Sandra Bastenia was the last person to be auditioned. Were you part of that process and when she came in, did she...? I, I, was, I was at one remove from it. I saw, okay. I saw some of the tapes. Yeah. I, I wasn't there for the physical audition, but it must have been pretty amazing because they already had a shortlist. The shortlist was locked. And then Colin was asked, would you like to meet a few more, a few more kids? And reluctantly, wearily, he said, yeah, OK. And the last girl to walk into the room was Senya. And also, as well as her, you've got a great cast in this, Glenn Close, Jamie Arterton. You must be delighted with the people that have it's come unbelievable. for this. The, the whole ensemble. I mean, obviously, Gemma, Glenn and Paddy speak for themselves. But Faseo Akinade as Gallagher, uh, Anthony Welsh as Dylan, Dominic Tipper. It was, it's like a, a, just a wonderful ensemble cast. There isn't a single weak performance in the film from, from my point of view. And the reaction, obviously, from, from the young audience has been very, very good. It seems Are you to delighted be. with that as well, yeah. I can imagine? It's, it's, it's been very well received. We, we've, we've, had, we've had a wild ride so far. You know, we've had screenings in Locarno, in Toronto. I was in Fife last night oh, wow. for the Scottish, the Scottish premiere. And uh, it's just been amazing seeing audiences respond to it. And also, I was at Toronto, Midnight Mandis, which is such an kind of iconic and crazy thing. And all yeah. the fans go mad for this kind of stuff. That, that, that was incredible. We had a Q&A at 2 in the morning. And wow. the, whole, the whole audience <laughs> stayed. And then we spilled out on the pavement. We were still talking about the film <laughs> at like 3 in the morning. Uh, just as a, a, a different question, just to mix it up a little bit, uh, you've worked on a few DC and Marvel projects. Um, are you a fan of what they're doing with the cinematic universes and all these characters coming to life now? Are there any characters that you want to see on I, I, the screen at some point? I do love a good superhero movie. <laughs> uh, I'm a particular fan of everything that Joss Whedon does with yes, the Marvel yeah, characters because he, he's one of my role models. Uh, but I also love Deadpool. I thought Deadpool was fantastic in the way that it kind of subverted yeah. those superhero uh, tropes. No, it's it's, it's wonderful to see comics becoming mainstream yeah. at last, at yeah. long last. Yeah. Fantastic. Well, thank you so much for your time. Thank you, thank you. Thank you so much. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey You Guys. Hey You Guys, huh? Is that from the Goonies? Nice. Hey You Guys.